Hi there and welcome to a series of short video clips from The Real Wine Company about how to taste wine and some of the main grape varieties that go into the wines that we all drink on a, on a regular basis. Of course we all know how to drink wine, that's quite easy, but um, how to taste it like the professionals is another matter altogether and we're going to look at how to do that, starting off with the colour, uh, then the smell and then the taste. And We're going to go straight into the colour, because why not, because we're here. So with the white wine, the, the juice is clear in the grape, but the skin is colourless as well, so you don't get any colour coming through. With a red wine at the other end of the extreme, you leave the skins on during the fermentation process, and all the colour comes from the skins is leached through during fermentation, so you have it, one of those. But in the middle you've got the rosé. If you want a rosé, instead of leaving the skins on for, say, 12 days for the entire fermentation process, it might be only 12 hours, as in this case, um, and you get a much lighter colour. You can have a very pale rosé, uh, like a blush, where maybe uh, they haven't even left the skins on at all. They've merely pressed the grapes and just a tiny bit of colour has come out of the skins before they start the fermentation. Uh, you could have a deeper rosé where they may be on, been on the skins for 12, 15 hours, um, or something like this somewhere in between. With a red wine, when you come to look at it, a young red wine is very purple around the edges, and as the red wine gets older, it starts going more browner, uh, redder and then browner. So the older a red wine gets, the browner the colour goes. If it starts getting very, very brown, that's a sign of oxidation, uh, and, and that can be, a, can be a bad sign, particularly if it's a young wine and it's brown, alarm bells should start ringing, it's probably not good enough. If it's got a lovely, young, vibrant colour, go away and drink and, and glug it with pleasure.